The electric dipole moment is a measure of the separation of positive and negative electrical charges within a system, that is, a measure of the system's overall polarity. The SI units for electric dipole moment are Coulomb meter C, M. however, the most common unit is the Debye D. .Theoretically, an electric dipole is defined by the first order term of the multipole expansion, it consists of two equal and opposite charges that are infinitely close together. This is unrealistic, as real dipoles have separated charge. However, because the charge separation is very small compared to everyday lengths, the error introduced by treating real dipoles like they are theoretically perfect is usually negligible. The dipole's direction usually points from the negative charge towards the positive charge. <laughs> <laughs> Elementary definition Often in physics the dimensions of a massive object can be ignored and can be treated as a point-like object, i.e. a point particle. Point particles with electric charge are referred to as point charges. Two point charges, one with charge plus Q and the other one with charge minus Q separated by a distance d, constitute an electric dipole a simple case of an electric multipole. For this case, the electric dipole moment has a magnitude p equals Q D display style P equals Q D and is directed from the negative charge to the positive one. Some authors may split D in half and use S equals D two since this quantity is the distance between either charge and the center of the dipole, leading to a factor of two in the definition. A stronger mathematical definition is to use vector algebra, since a quantity with magnitude and direction, like the dipole moment of two point charges, can be expressed in vector form. P equals Q D display style math BF P equals Q math BF D where D is the displacement vector pointing from the negative charge to the positive charge the electric dipole moment vector P also points from the negative charge to the positive charge an idealization of this two-charge system is the electrical point dipole consisting of two infinite charges only infinitesimally separated, but with a finite p. This quantity is used in the definition of polarization density. Topic: <laughs> Torque. An object with an electric dipole moment is subject to a torque tau when placed in an external electric field. The torque tends to align the dipole with the field. A dipole aligned parallel to an electric field has lower potential energy than a dipole making some angle with it. For a spatially uniform electric field E, the torque is given by tau equals p times E display style bold symbol tau equals math bf p times math bf E where p is the dipole moment, and the symbol times refers to the vector cross product. The field vector and the dipole vector define a plane, and the torque is directed normal to that plane with the direction given by the right-hand rule. A dipole-oriented co- or anti-parallel to the direction in which a non-uniform electric field is increasing gradient of the field will experience a torque, as well as a force in the direction of its dipole moment. It can be shown that this force will always be parallel to the dipole moment regardless of co- or anti-parallel orientation of the dipole. Topic: <laughs> Expression general case. More generally, for a continuous distribution of charge confined to a volume 5, the corresponding expression for the dipole moment is P R equals V Rho R zero R zero minus R D three R zero Display style Math BF P Math BF R equals int limits underscore V Rho Math BF R underscore zero left Math BF R underscore zero Math BF R right D carrot three Math BF R underscore zero where R locates the point of observation and D three R zero denotes an elementary volume in V for an array of point charges, the charge density becomes a sum of Dirac delta functions. Rho R 
equals i equals 1 n q i delta r minus r i display style row math bfr equals sum underscore i equals 1 caret n q underscore i delta left math bfr math bfr underscore i right where each re is a vector from some reference point to the charge chi substitution into the above integration formula provides p r equals i equals 1 n Q I V Delta R zero minus R I R zero minus R D three R zero equals I equals one N Q I R I minus R Display style Math BF P Math BF R equals sum underscore I equals one carrot N Q underscore I int limits underscore V delta left Math BF R underscore zero Math BF R underscore I right left Math BF R underscore zero Math BF R right D carrot three Math BF R underscore zero equals sum underscore I equals one carrot N Q underscore I left Math BF R underscore I Math BF R right. This expression is equivalent to the previous expression in the case of charge neutrality and n equals 2. For two opposite charges, denoting the location of the positive charge of the pair as R plus and the location of the negative charge as R minus P R equals Q 1 R 1 minus R plus Q two R two minus R equals Q R plus minus R minus Q R minus minus R equals Q R plus minus R minus equals Q D Display style Math BF P Math BF R equals Q underscore one Math BF R underscore one Math BF R plus Q underscore two Math BF R underscore two Math BF R equals Q Math BF R underscore plus Math BF R Q Math BF R underscore Math BF R equals Q Math BF R underscore plus Math BF R underscore equals Q Math BF D Showing that the dipole moment vector is directed from the negative charge to the positive charge because the position vector of a point is directed outward from the origin to that point. The dipole moment is particularly useful in the context of an overall neutral system of charges, for example a pair of opposite charges, or a neutral conductor in a uniform electric field. For such a system of charges, visualized as an array of paired opposite charges, the relation for electric dipole moment is P R equals I equals one N V Q I Delta R zero minus R I plus D I minus Delta R Zero minus R I R zero minus R D three R zero equals I equals one N Q I R I plus 
d i minus r minus r i minus r equals i equals one n q i d i equals i equals one n p i display style begin aligned math b f p math b f r and equals sum underscore i equals one caret n int limits underscore v q underscore i left delta left math b f r underscore zero left math b f r underscore i plus math b f d underscore i right right delta left math b f r underscore zero math b f R underscore I right right left Math BF R underscore zero Math BF R right D carrot three Math BF R underscore zero and equals sum underscore I equals one carrot N Q underscore I left Math BF R underscore I plus Math BF D underscore I Math BF R left Math BF R underscore I Math BF R right right and equals sum underscore I equals one carrot N Q underscore I Math BF D underscore I equals sum underscore I equals one carrot N math BF P underscore I end aligned where R is the point of observation and D equals re minus re re being the position of the positive charge in the dipole I and re the position of the negative charge. This is the vector sum of the individual dipole moments of the neutral charge pairs. Because of overall charge neutrality, the dipole moment is independent of the observer's position R. Thus, the value of p is independent of the choice of reference point, provided the overall charge of the system is zero. When discussing the dipole moment of a non-neutral system, such as the dipole moment of the proton, a dependence on the choice of reference point arises. In such cases it is conventional to choose the reference point to be the center of mass of the system, not some arbitrary origin. This choice is not only a matter of convention, the notion of dipole moment is essentially derived from the mechanical notion of torque, and as in mechanics, it is computationally and theoretically useful to choose the center of mass as the observation point. For a charged molecule the center of charge should be the reference point instead of the center of mass. For neutral systems the reference's point is not important. The dipole moment is an intrinsic property of the system. Potential and field of an electric dipole An ideal dipole consists of two opposite charges with infinitesimal separation. The potential and field of such an ideal dipole are found next as a limiting case of an example of two opposite charges at non-zero separation. Two closely spaced opposite charges have a potential of the form phi r equals Q four pi epsilon zero R minus R plus minus Q four pi epsilon zero R minus R minus Display style phi math bf r equals frac q four pi var epsilon underscore zero left math bf r math bf r underscore plus right frac q four pi var epsilon underscore zero left math bf r math bf r underscore right with charge separation d defined as d equals r plus minus R minus display style math bf d equals math bf r underscore plus math bf r underscore the position relative to their center of mass, assuming equal masses r and the unit vector in the direction of r are given by r equals r minus r plus plus r minus Two R carrot equals R R display style math BF R equals math BF R frac math BF R underscore plus plus math BF R underscore two quad hat math BF R equals frac math BF R R Taylor expansion in D R C multipole expansion and quadrupole allows this potential to be expressed as a series. Phi R equals one four pi epsilon 
zero Q D R carrot R two plus O D two R two approximately equals one four Pi Epsilon zero P R carrot R two Display style phi math BF R equals FRAC one four Pi var epsilon underscore zero FRAC Q math BF D C D O T hat math BF R R carrot two plus O left FRAC D carrot two R carrot two right approximately FRAC one four Pi var epsilon underscore zero FRAC math BF P C D O T hat math BF R R carrot two where higher order terms in the series are vanishing at large distances, r, compared to d. Here, the electric dipole moment p is, as above, p equals q d math bf p equals q math bf d. The result for the dipole potential also can be expressed as phi r equals minus P one four Pi Epsilon zero R Display style phi Math BF R equals Math BF P C D O T Math BF Nabla F R A C one four Pi var epsilon underscore zero R which relates the dipole potential to that of a point charge. A key point is that the potential of the dipole falls off faster with distance r than that of the point charge. The electric field of the dipole is the negative gradient of the potential, leading to E r equals 3 p r caret r caret minus p 4 pi Epsilon zero R three Display style Math BF E left Math BF R right equals FRAC three left Math BF P C D O T hat Math BF R right hat Math BF R Math BF P four Pi var epsilon underscore zero R carrot three Thus, although two closely spaced opposite charges are not quite an ideal electric dipole because their potential at short distances is not that of a dipole, at distances much larger than their separation, their dipole moment P appears directly in their potential and field. As the two charges are brought closer together D is made smaller, the dipole term in the multipole expansion based on the ratio D, R becomes the only significant term at ever closer distances R, and in the limit of infinitesimal separation the dipole term in this expansion is all that matters. As D is made infinitesimal, however, the dipole charge must be made to increase to hold P constant. This limiting process results in a point dipole. Topic: Dipole moment density and polarization density. The dipole moment of an array of charges p equals i equals one n q i d i. Display style math BF P equals sum underscore I equals one carrot N Q underscore I math BF D underscore I determines the degree of polarity of the array, but for a neutral array it is simply a vector property of the array with no information about the array's absolute location. The dipole moment density of the array P R contains both the location of the array and its dipole moment. When it comes time to calculate the electric field in some region containing the array, Maxwell's equations are solved, and the information about the charge array is contained in the polarization density P of Maxwell's equations. Depending upon how fine-grained an assessment of the electric field is required, more or less information about the charge array will have to be expressed by P As explained below, sometimes it is sufficiently accurate to take P equals P 
Sometimes a more detailed description is needed for example, supplementing the dipole moment density with an additional quadrupole density and sometimes even more elaborate versions of P R are necessary. It now is explored just in what way the polarization density P R that enters Maxwell's equations is related to the dipole moment P of an overall neutral array of charges, and also to the dipole moment density P R which describes not only the dipole moment, but also the array location. Only static situations are considered in what follows, so P R has no time dependence, and there is no displacement current. First is some discussion of the polarization density P R. That discussion is followed with several particular examples. A formulation of Maxwell's equations based upon division of charges and currents into free and bound charges and currents leads to introduction of the D and P fields D equals epsilon 0 e plus p display style math bfd equals var epsilon underscore 0 math bf e plus math bf p where p is called the polarization density in this formulation the divergence of this equation yields d equals rho f equals Epsilon zero e plus p display style nabla c d o t math b f d equals rho underscore f equals var epsilon underscore zero nabla c d o t math b f e plus nabla c d o t math b f p and as the divergence term in e is the total charge and rho f is free charge we are left with the relation P equals minus rho b display style nabla c d o t math b f p equals rho underscore b with rho b as the bound charge, by which is meant the difference between the total and the free charge densities. As an aside, in the absence of magnetic effects, Maxwell's equations specify that times e equals Zero. Display style nabla times math bf e equals bold symbol zero, which implies times d minus p equals zero. Display style nabla times left math bf d math bf p right equals bold symbol zero. Applying Helmholtz decomposition, d minus p equals minus phi display style math bf dp equals nabla var phi for some scalar potential phi and d minus p equals epsilon 0 e equals rho f plus Rho B equals minus two phi. Display style nabla c d o t math b f d math b f p equals var epsilon underscore zero nabla c d o t math b f e equals rho underscore f plus rho underscore b equals nabla caret two var phi. Suppose the charges are divided into free and bound, and the potential is divided into phi equals phi f plus phi b. Display style var phi equals var phi underscore f plus var phi underscore b. Satisfaction of the boundary conditions upon phi may be divided arbitrarily between phi f and phi b because only the sum phi must satisfy these conditions. It follows that P is simply proportional to the electric field due to the charges selected as bound, with boundary conditions that prove convenient. In particular, when no free charge is present, one possible choice is P equals epsilon 0 E. Next is discussed how several different dipole moment descriptions of a medium relate to the polarization entering Maxwell's equations. Topic. Medium with charge and dipole densities 
As described next, a model for polarization moment density P R results in a polarization P R equals P R Display style math bfp math bfr equals math bfp math bfr restricted to the same model. For a smoothly varying dipole moment distribution p r, the corresponding bound charge density is simply p r equals rho b. Display style nabla c d o t math b f p math b f r equals rho underscore b, as we will establish shortly via integration by parts. However, if p r exhibits an abrupt step in dipole moment at a boundary between two regions, p r results in a surface charge component of bound charge. This surface charge can be treated through a surface integral, or by using discontinuity conditions at the boundary, as illustrated in the various examples below. As a first example relating dipole moment to polarization, consider a medium made up of a continuous charge density ρ and a continuous dipole moment distribution P R. The potential at a position R is Φ R equals 1 4 Pi epsilon zero rho r zero r minus r zero d three r zero plus one four pi epsilon zero p r Zero R minus R zero R minus R zero three D three R zero Display style phi math BF R equals FRAC one four Pi var epsilon underscore zero int FRAC row left math BF R underscore zero right left math BF R math BF R underscore zero right D carrot three math BF R underscore zero plus FRAC one four Pi var epsilon underscore zero int FRAC math BF P left math BF R underscore zero right C D T left Math BF R Math BF R underscore zero right Math BF R Math BF R underscore zero carrot three D carrot three Math BF R underscore zero Where rho R is the unpaired charge density and P R is the dipole moment density. Using an identity R zero one R minus R Zero equals R minus R zero R minus R zero three Display style nabla underscore math BF R underscore zero FRAC one left Math BF R Math BF R underscore zero right equals FRAC Math BF R Math BF R underscore zero left Math BF R Math BF R underscore zero right carrot three The polarization integral can be transformed one four Pi Epsilon Zero P R zero R minus R zero R minus R zero three D three R zero equals one four Pi Epsilon zero P R zero R zero one R minus R zero D three R zero equals one four Pi Epsilon 
0 r 0 p r 0 1 r minus r 0 d 3 r 0 minus 1 4 pi epsilon 0 r 0 P R zero R minus R zero D three R zero display style begin aligned end FRAC one four Pi var epsilon underscore zero int FRAC Math BF P left Math BF R underscore zero right C D O T Math BF R Math BF R underscore zero left Math BF R Math BF R underscore zero right carrot three D carrot three Math BF R underscore zero equals F R RAC one four Pi var epsilon underscore zero int Math BF P left Math BF R underscore zero right C D O T Nabla underscore Math BF R underscore zero F R A C one left Math BF R Math BF R underscore zero right D carrot three Math BF R underscore zero equals and F R A C one four Pi var epsilon underscore zero int Nabla underscore Math BF R underscore zero C D O T left Math B F P left Math B F R underscore zero right F R A C one left Math B F R Math B F R underscore zero right right D carrot three Math B F R underscore zero F R A C one four Pi var epsilon underscore zero int F R A C Nabla underscore Math B F R underscore zero C D O T Math B F P left Math B F R underscore zero right left Math B F R Math BF R underscore zero right D carrot three Math BF R underscore zero end aligned the first term can be transformed to an integral over the surface bounding the volume of integration and contributes a surface charge density discussed later. Putting this result back into the potential and ignoring the surface charge for now. Phi R equals one four Pi Epsilon zero Rho R zero minus R zero P R zero R minus R zero D three R zero Display style phi math BF R equals FRAC one four Pi var epsilon underscore zero int FRAC row left Math BF R underscore zero right Nabla underscore Math BF R underscore zero C D O T Math BF P left Math BF R underscore zero right left Math BF R Math BF R underscore zero right D carrot three Math BF R underscore zero where the volume integration extends only up to the bounding surface, and does not include this surface. The potential is determined by the total charge, which the above shows consists of rho total r 0 equals rho r 0 minus r 0 p r Zero display style row underscore text total left math bfr underscore zero right equals row left math bfr underscore zero right nabla underscore math bfr underscore zero c d o t math bf p left math bfr underscore zero right showing that minus r zero p r zero equals Rho B display style nabla underscore math BFr underscore 0 C D O T math BFP left math BFr underscore 0 right equals Rho underscore B in short the dipole moment density P R plays the role of the polarization density P for this medium notice P R has a non-zero divergence equal to the bound charge density as modeled in this approximation 
It may be noted that this approach can be extended to include all the multipoles, dipole, quadrupole, etc. Using the relation d equals rho f display style nabla c d o t math b f d equals rho underscore f, the polarization density is found to be p r equals p dip minus p quad plus display style math bf p math bf r equals math bf p underscore text dip nabla c d o t math bf p underscore text quad plus l dots where the added terms are meant to indicate contributions from higher multipoles Evidently, inclusion of higher multipoles signifies that the polarization density p no longer is determined by a dipole moment density p alone. For example, in considering scattering from a charge array, different multipoles scatter an electromagnetic wave differently and independently, requiring a representation of the charges that goes beyond the dipole approximation. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Surface charge Above, discussion was deferred for the first term in the expression for the potential due to the dipoles. Integrating the divergence results in a surface charge. The figure at the right provides an intuitive idea of why a surface charge arises. The figure shows a uniform array of identical dipoles between two surfaces. Internally, the heads and tails of dipoles are adjacent and cancel. At the bounding surfaces, however, no cancellation occurs. Instead, on one surface the dipole heads create a positive surface charge, while at the opposite surface the dipole tails create a negative surface charge. These two opposite surface charges create a net electric field in a direction opposite to the direction of the dipoles. This idea is given mathematical form using the potential expression above. The potential is phi r equals 1 4 pi Epsilon zero R zero P R zero one R minus R zero D three R zero minus one four Pi Epsilon Zero R zero P R zero R minus R zero D three R zero Display style phi left math bf r right equals frac one four pi var epsilon underscore zero in nabla underscore math bf r underscore zero c d o t left math bf p left math bf r underscore zero right frac one left math bf r math bf r underscore zero right right d caret three math bf r underscore zero frac one four pi var epsilon underscore Zero int frac nabla underscore math bf r underscore zero c d o t math bf p left math bf r underscore zero right left math bf r math bf r underscore zero right d caret three math bf r underscore zero. Using the divergence theorem, the divergence term transforms into the surface integral one four pi epsilon. Zero R zero P R zero one R minus R zero D three R 
0 equals 1 4 pi epsilon 0 p r 0 d a 0 r minus r 0 display style begin aligned end frac 1 4 pi var epsilon underscore 0 int nabla underscore math bf r underscore 0 c d o t left math bf p left math bf r underscore 0 right frac 1 left math bf r math bf r underscore 0 right right d caret 3 math bf r underscore zero equals end frac one four pi var epsilon underscore zero int frac math bf p left math bf r underscore zero right c d o t d math bf a underscore zero left math bf r math bf r underscore zero right end aligned with da zero an element of surface area of the volume. In the event that p r is a constant, only the surface term survives. Phi R equals one four pi epsilon zero one R minus R zero P D A zero Display style phi math bf r equals frac one four pi var epsilon underscore zero int frac one left math bf r math bf r underscore zero right math bf p c d o t d math bf o underscore zero with da zero an elementary area of the surface bounding the charges. In words, the potential due to a constant p inside the surface is equivalent to that of a surface charge. Sigma equals P D A display style sigma equals math BF P C D O T D math BF a, which is positive for surface elements with a component in the direction of P and negative for surface elements pointed oppositely. Usually, the direction of a surface element is taken to be that of the outward normal to the surface at the location of the element. If the bounding surface is a sphere, and the point of observation is at the center of this sphere, the integration over the surface of the sphere is zero, the positive and negative surface charge contributions to the potential cancel. If the point of observation is off-center, however, a net potential can result depending upon the situation because the positive and negative charges are at different distances from the point of observation. The field due to the surface charge is E R equals Minus one four pi epsilon zero r one r minus r zero p d a zero Display style math bf e left math bf r right equals frac one four pi var epsilon underscore zero nabla underscore math bf r int frac one left math bf r math bf r underscore zero right math bf p c d o t d math bf underscore zero which, at the center of a spherical bounding surface is not zero the fields of negative and positive charges on opposite sides of the center add because both fields point the same way but is instead E equals minus P 3 epsilon 0 Display style math bf e equals frac math bf P 3 var epsilon underscore 0 if we suppose the polarization of the dipoles was induced by an external field, the polarization field opposes the applied field and sometimes is called a depolarization field. In the case when the polarization is outside a spherical cavity, the field in the cavity due to the surrounding dipoles is in the same direction as the polarization. In particular, if the electric susceptibility is introduced through the approximation P R equals epsilon Zero chi r e r display style math bf p math bf r equals var epsilon underscore zero chi math bf r math bf e math bf r, where e in this case and in the following represent the external field which induces the polarization. Then p r 
equals chi r epsilon 0 e r equals minus rho b Display style nabla c d o t math b f p math b f r equals nabla c d o t left chi math b f r var epsilon underscore zero math b f e math b f r right equals rho underscore b. Whenever chi r is used to model a step discontinuity at the boundary between two regions, the step produces a surface charge layer. For example, integrating along a normal to the bounding surface from a point just interior to one surface to another point just exterior epsilon 0 n caret chi r plus e r plus minus chi r minus e r Minus equals one a n d omega n rho b equals zero. Display style var epsilon underscore zero hat math bf n c d o t left chi left math bf r underscore plus right math bf e left math bf r underscore plus right chi left math bf r underscore right math bf e left math bf r underscore right right equals frac one a underscore n in d omega underscore n rho underscore b equals zero where an omega and indicate the area and volume of an elementary region straddling the boundary between the regions and n caret display style hat math bf n a unit normal to the surface the right side vanishes as the volume shrinks inasmuch as rho b is finite indicating a discontinuity in e and therefore a surface charge that is, where the modeled medium includes a step in permittivity, the polarization density corresponding to the dipole moment density P R equals chi R E R Display style Math BF P Math BF R equals chi Math BF R Math BF E Math BF R necessarily includes the contribution of a surface charge a physically more realistic modeling of pr would have the dipole moment density drop off rapidly but smoothly to zero at the boundary of the confining region rather than making a sudden step to zero density then the surface charge will not concentrate in an infinitely thin surface but instead being the divergence of a smoothly varying dipole moment density will distribute itself throughout a thin but finite transition layer Topic dielectric sphere In uniform external electric field the above general remarks about surface charge are made more concrete by considering the example of a dielectric sphere in a uniform electric field. The sphere is found to adopt a surface charge related to the dipole moment of its interior. A uniform external electric field is supposed to point in the z direction, and spherical polar coordinates are introduced so the potential created by this field is, phi infinity equals minus e infinity z equals minus e infinity r cos theta. Display style phi underscore in t equals e underscore in t z equals e underscore in t r cos theta. The sphere is assumed to be described by a dielectric constant kappa, that is d equals kappa e zero e. Display style math bf d equals kappa epsilon underscore zero math bf e. And inside the sphere, the potential satisfies Laplace's equation. Skipping a few details, the solution inside the sphere is phi equals a r cos theta. Display style phi underscore. While outside the sphere, phi greater than equals b r plus c r two cos theta. Display style phi underscore greater than equals left bridge plus frac c r caret two right cos theta. At large distances, phi greater than phi infinity so b. Topic. Minus e infinity continuity of potential and of the radial component of displacement d k zero e determine the other two constants. Supposing the radius of the sphere is r a equals 
minus three kappa plus two e infinity c equals kappa minus one kappa plus two e infinity r three Display style a equals frac 3 kappa plus 2 e underscore infinity c equals frac kappa minus 1 kappa plus 2 e underscore infinity r caret 3. As a consequence, the potential is phi greater than equals minus r plus kappa minus 1 kappa plus 2 r 3 r 2 e infinity cos theta display style phi underscore greater than equals left r plus frac kappa minus 1 kappa plus 2 frac r caret 3 r caret 2 right e underscore in a t cos theta which is the potential due to applied field and in addition a dipole in the direction of the applied field the z direction of dipole moment p equals 4 pi epsilon 0 kappa minus 1 kappa plus 2 r 3 e infinity display style math bf P equals four pi var epsilon underscore zero left frac kappa minus one kappa plus two r caret three right math bf e underscore in t or per unit volume p v equals three epsilon zero kappa minus one kappa plus two e infinity display style frac math bf p v equals three var epsilon underscore zero left frac kappa minus one kappa plus two right math bf e underscore in t T, the factor kappa minus one kappa plus two is called the clausius masotti factor and shows that the induced polarization flips sine of kappa. The potential inside the sphere is phi equals minus three kappa plus two e infinity r cos theta display style phi underscore leading to the field inside the sphere minus phi equals three kappa plus two e infinity equals one minus kappa minus one kappa plus two e infinity display style nabla phi underscore showing the depolarizing effect of the dipole. Notice that the field inside the sphere is uniform and parallel to the applied field. The dipole moment is uniform throughout the interior of the sphere. The surface charge density on the sphere is the difference between the radial field components. Sigma equals three epsilon zero kappa minus one kappa plus two e infinity cos theta equals 1 v p r caret display style sigma equals 3 var epsilon underscore 0 frac kappa minus 1 kappa plus 2 e underscore in a t cos theta equals frac 1 v math bf p c d o t hat math bf r this linear dielectric example shows that the dielectric constant treatment is equivalent to the uniform dipole moment model and leads to zero charge everywhere except for the surface charge at the boundary of the sphere. <laughs> General media If observation is confined to regions sufficiently remote from a system of charges, a multipole expansion of the exact polarization density can be made. By truncating this expansion for example, retaining only the dipole terms, or only the dipole and quadrupole terms, or etc., the results of the previous section are regained. In particular, truncating the expansion at the dipole term, the result is indistinguishable from the polarization density generated by a uniform dipole moment confined to the charge region. To the accuracy of this dipole approximation, as shown in the previous section, the dipole moment density P R, which includes not only P but the location of P serves as P R. At locations inside the charge array, to connect an array of paired charges to an approximation involving only a dipole moment density P R requires additional considerations. The simplest approximation is to replace the charge array with a model of ideal infinitesimally spaced dipoles. 
In particular, as in the example above that uses a constant dipole moment density confined to a finite region, a surface charge and depolarization field results. A more general version of this model which allows the polarization to vary with position is the customary approach using electric susceptibility or electrical permittivity. A more complex model of the point charge array introduces an effective medium by averaging the microscopic charges, for example, the averaging can arrange that only dipole fields play a role. A related approach is to divide the charges into those nearby the point of observation, and those far enough away to allow multipole expansion. The nearby charges then give rise to local field effects. In a common model of this type, the distant charges are treated as a homogeneous medium using a dielectric constant, and the nearby charges are treated only in a dipole approximation. The approximation of a medium or an array of charges by only dipoles and their associated dipole moment density is sometimes called the point dipole approximation, the discrete dipole approximation, or simply the dipole approximation. Electric dipole moments of fundamental particles Not to be confused with spin which refers to the magnetic dipole moments of particles, much experimental work is continuing on measuring the electric dipole moments of fundamental and composite particles, namely those of the electron and neutron, respectively. As EDMs violate both the parity P and time reversal T symmetries, their values yield a mostly model-independent measure of CP violation in nature assuming CPT symmetry is valid. Therefore, values for these EDMs place strong constraints upon the scale of CP violation that extensions to the standard model of particle physics may allow. Current generations of experiments are designed to be sensitive to the supersymmetry range of EDMs, providing complementary experiments to those done at the LHC. Indeed, many theories are inconsistent with the current limits and have effectively been ruled out, and established theory permits a much larger value than these limits, leading to the strong CP problem and prompting searches for new particles such as the axion. Dipole moments of molecules Dipole moments in molecules are responsible for the behavior of a substance in the presence of external electric fields. The dipoles tend to be aligned to the external field which can be constant or time-dependent. This effect forms the basis of a modern experimental technique called dielectric spectroscopy. Dipole moments can be found in common molecules such as water and also in biomolecules such as proteins. By means of the total dipole moment of some material, one can compute the dielectric constant, which is related to the more intuitive concept of conductivity. If m t o t display style math call m underscore erm tot is the total dipole moment of the sample, then the dielectric constant is given by e equals 1 plus k m tot 2 display style epsilon equals 1 plus k left angle math call m underscore text tot caret 2 right wrangle where k is a constant and m tot 2 equals m tot T equals zero M tot T equals zero Display style left Langle math call M underscore text tot carrot two right wrangle equals left Langle math call M underscore text tot T equals zero math call M underscore text tot T equals zero right wrangle is the time correlation function of the total dipole moment. In general the total dipole moment have contributions coming from translations and rotations of the molecules in the sample m tot equals m trans plus m rot Display style math call m underscore text tot equals math call m underscore text trans plus math call m underscore text rot. Therefore, the dielectric constant and the conductivity has contributions from both terms. 
This approach can be generalized to compute the frequency dependent dielectric function. It is possible to calculate dipole moments from electronic structure theory, either as a response to constant electric fields or from the density matrix. Such values, however, are not directly comparable to experiment due to the potential presence of nuclear quantum effects, which can be substantial for even simple systems like the ammonia molecule. Coupled cluster theory especially CCSD -T can give very accurate dipole moments, although it is possible to get reasonable estimates within about 5% from density functional theory, especially if hybrid or double hybrid functionals are employed. The dipole moment of a molecule can also be calculated based on the molecular structure using the concept of group contribution methods. See also Topic. References and inline notes Topic. Further reading Melvin Schwartz 1987. Electrical Dipole Moment. Principles of Electrodynamics Reprint of 1972 ed. Courier Dover Publications. p. 49 ff. ISBN 978-0-486-65493-5 Topic: External links Electric dipole moment, from Eric Weistein's World of Physics Electrostatic dipole multiphysics model